Okay, so you've arrived in Hobart. You've got no car and no clue how to get around. What the hell are you gonna do? Simple, you're gonna get a bus card, or as it's called here, a green card. This little card can take you to all sorts of attractions and places in Hobart, including Mona, the foot of Kunanyi, Cascade Brewery, and more. The first step you must take to get your green card is heading to a green card agent. The main one is the metro shop on the corner of the Elizabeth Street Mall, closest to the bus mall. But there's also a lot of other locations where you can buy them and top up your card, which are on the screen right now. When you ask to get a green card, you'll have to fill out this form, which you need to give some info including your address, phone number, date of birth and so on. You may also be eligible to get a student green card if you're currently or studying in Australia. You just will need to show this to the staff to sign up for this concession, which lets you go on the bus for half the price of a non-student adult. Once you fill this out, you will need to buy the green card which costs $5 and you'll also need to top it up with some money. The amount you put onto the card will vary depending on how long your stay in Hobart is and if you have a student concession. So try to calculate how much you will need depending on your specific situation. Important to note that the daily cap on weekdays is $9.60 for adults and $4.80 on weekends and public holidays. So definitely don't put more than the amount of your days times the daily cap. Okay, so now you've got your green card, it's time to use it. This part is really simple. Go to Google Maps and type in the place you want to go. Then tap on the public transport option. As there are no other public transportation systems in Tasmania, this tab shows you how to get to your destination using the bus. Google will then tell you which bus stop to go to and how to get there. Once you arrive at your bus stop, wait for the bus to come. Google may say it's coming in a minute, for example, but you may have to wait a little or a lot longer as Metro Taz is definitely not reliable or punctual. Once on the bus, however, you will be faced with a new challenge, getting off the bus. The easiest way to do this is to follow the little blue dot in Google Maps until you are just one stop before your stop, then press the button to get off. And boom, there you have it. You have acquired and used your green card. If you have any questions about public transportation in Hobart, ask me in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe for more videos.